let me show you how to prepare this finger licking and very rich igusi soup hi lovelies thank you for stopping by and welcome to recipes by jenny now to the star of this dish igusi seeds uziza seeds and dawa dawa this combination here is a winner for your goosey soup. Try this and thank me later in the comment section. Now, on medium heat, toast for around 2 minutes, continuously stirring. After that, blend until you have a smooth consistency and set aside. To a pot add the protein of choice, I'll start by cooking the toughest meat, which is shaki and cow skin first. Add blended onions and pepper. Add enough water to cook the meat until it is well done. When the meat is almost done, add the rest of the protein. I am using beef. Add a stockfish, salt, and beef bouillon seasoning. Cook for around 15 minutes. After 15 minutes, add palm oil. and the blended igusi add enough water and dry fish and simmer on medium heat for 15 minutes. Please do not skip this step. It is important your igusi properly cooks as this prevents it from becoming rancid and upsetting to the stomach. Also add ground crayfish. After cooking for 15 minutes, add your vegetable of choice. I am using uziza leaves. Mix together and cook for around 3 minutes. If you like what you've seen in the video so far, kindly give the video a thumbs up and subscribe if you're not. Thank you very much. To finish up this soup, I would be adding a bit of palm oil and ground crayfish. Mix together and cook for just a minute. And at this point, ladies and gentlemen, turn off the heat and voila, your igusi soup is ready to be enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching the video. If you've watched until this point, let me know in the comment section if you tried this recipe. And please don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and turn on the notification bell so you receive a notification whenever I post a new video. And until next time, remain blessed.